What is going on, everybody? We are back on it. My Hero Academia, Season 5, Episode 15. Apologize for the kind of slow videos the second half of this week. I was on vacation for five days, like literally just out. First vacation I've had in years. Five plus, maybe. <laughs> um, so Patreon members and YouTube, we were kind of slow on the videos, I think, after like Tuesday or Wednesday or so. Um, so I apologize for that, but we're back on it. Everybody will be seeing this on Monday. Tomorrow, Patreon members, I think we're on... Uh, one piece we're somewhere in like the 60s because we took a huge skip because you guys told me to take a skip so we i know we skipped a little bit then we did like 50s somewhere in the 50s and we skipped again up to like 62 63 we're somewhere in there and then tomorrow youtube you guys will get i think we're in the middle of the r long arc we're about 10 to 12 episodes behind for youtube and they will get our same like parasite one piece sprinkled throughout the week and we'll kind of go from there i had a couple people hit me up Saying, you know, if you're, I should skip up to like the four minute mark, maybe skip minute six through eight here. It's kind of spoilerish. But then I had talked to my Patreon members. Someone told me, unless it's, I'm a manga reader, like me, if I'm anime only, there, it's not going to, these scenes that I should skip aren't going to mean anything to me. So I'm going to go ahead and watch all the way through. But I did have a couple people reach out saying, you know, you might want to skip up to the four minute mark and then skip, you know, two minutes in the middle. So I don't know what all that means. Um, but we did have last week off of My Hero. So we're back on it here, and we will um just go ahead and go from there. We are pressing play on the episode right now. Oh, try it again now. Here we go. Oh, what's that on his feathers? Is he's got like is that GPS on there? Trying to track where he's going. I don't know if there's someone told me an after credit or not. I have to remember to look through at the end. And then I got clarification on this. I thought this was. He Heroes working like underground, but still heroes. But this insert this liberation shit. Um, is like bad, bad. Oh, twice. So now we've got three separate power... Uh, it's actually just the League. I see Toga and Dobby back there and shit. Huh. Yeah, there they are. But who's the guy leading this? Because where's Sugar Rocky and all this? Oh, shit. Four months. I wonder if he can get to the point where he could just level a city with his deterioration shit. Like, can I touch one end of a country and it just fall apart? Um, okay, so here comes the opening. So, I didn't know the League was involved with this liberation group. I thought we just introduced a whole new group. Um... So I was like, okay, we've got the heroes, you know, our hero agency, Endeavor, everybody that's, you know, having Hawks go undercover. Um, we've got the League of Villains, and then we've got this, like, subgroup, which is, like, maybe heroes who want to do the right thing by the hero group, but know with, like, certain regulations and things they can't be what they want to be, and they need to be able to act on their own, but they're not truly just evil like the League. So I thought we had these two, and the Liberation Group was, like, the one in the middle. Um, like, like, yes, we want to be, act on our own, but we're still not villains. We don't work with them, but clearly they're kind of working together there. Um, 
So what is the difference between the two, like these X heroes? Because when we had saw the one, I think his, he was like Pro Hero Go, they still introduced him as Pro Hero. So I'm like, okay, so he's still good, but no, he's just inter- introduced as a Pro Hero. Um, so we got to see kind of where this Liberation Group lies, like what makes them different from the League of Villains? Is Shigaraki in the League just using them so they can be the front shield while we still do stuff behind? Is it the other way around? Shigaraki's kind of doing his own things, but letting everything kind of mentally get run another way. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. (sighs) They've got some like underground movement. Four months, huh? So how does he prepare them without them noticing that the heroes are starting to move? See? What is happening here? Ay, 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 ay. He is secretly investigating the enemy. (laughs) All right, off I go. Better make sure they don't have anybody that can read mine. Mm Mm-hmm. Like this is this is bigger than anything the League of Villains is doing. The League was just this one-off thing, like, they were kind of, like, Shigaraki didn't have the mental to control or run that. This is some, like, all-for-one type shit. Like, mobilizing an entire country, sleeper agents, heroes working for. Um. But, like, is this, is Shigaraki running this? Or... Are they just joining with the Liberation because they seem to be aligned with what we want to do? They need these kids ready to go. What choice do you have? Who else? Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. Endeavor's going to come out and be like, no, those three are going to be in my back pocket. At all times. What other choice do they have? Like, if they fail, the students have to be ready. They're the next in line. Like, if they fail, and if they are to fall, then... Somebody's got to be ready, even if they're kids. Yeah, they were fucking ready to go. I wish you could work with Tsukiyomi a little bit more. But you know what makes a villain different from a hero, though? Villains are willing to go there. Heroes are not. Villains will kill to escape, to ensure victory... To just cause havoc, pain, make you as a hero just lose your shit. Oh, Mirio. If we had you, I'd I'd have faith. 
villains, you know, will try to uphold, you know, capture that type of stuff. That's what makes the weakness, I feel like, the most. There's nothing holding villains back. Heroes still have to be heroes, you know? Oh, brother. I feel I feel the uh, the anticipation. Quirk blazing here. She can control the flames on her head. For Oh, she's another fire type. He wants to know about their course a little bit. But he still can't fully use the power output. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> Yeah, he, everything's just, like, nerfed for him. Like, he's got the power, but, like... Okay. Calm down. Oh, God. I feel like this is when Gon's listening to uh, Knuckle explain his APR shit. Be able to have the power on. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. A flame girl. Damn. And he watched All Might. If there's anybody that might be able to help him besides All Might himself, I mean, shit. late bloomers, one of our late bloomers. He wants to know what his limitations are. He's like, shit, I can do whatever, so show me what I can't do. Yeah, he can, there's nothing, like, he's, he can, he's got mobility, strength, What does it mean to be a hero? Mm. He needs help with the... Yes. He needs help with the other side. He needs both sides if he wants to be successful. So weird that that was him. Hmm. 
Hmm. Don't hurt his feelings. Oh lord, this is getting deep, and Endeavor's just having to take it because, like, he's trying to take that next step. I mean, he deserves it, you know. That was in front of a room full of people, too. Yikes. What do you even say? Oh god, don't be a dick, though. Ay, ay, ay. This is what I wanted All Might to be able to do for Deku, with Deku. And we were never able to get it, so I'll take Endeavor as the next best thing. Hey, hey, hey. Put the hard work talent with the experience. Yeah. <laughs> But, like, the thing is, like, <laughs> with Todoroki... He leaves this ice trail. Like, does he have to always go back and clean that up? Does he just let it melt? Or, like, <laughs> how does that work? He's got six more quirks lined up, too. Good lord. He said, y'all want to get better than me? He didn't slow down like a car. He just kept it moving. He's like, y'all want to be better than me? Show me you could take somebody out before I do this winter. This man is flying, by the way. Like, call it what you want. He's propelling himself. The man is flying. <laughs> Mm-hmm. He's got his quirk so far down. It's kind of like when we've seen Bakugo move. Yeah, essentially. <laughs> Oh shit, go! Move your ass! Woohoo! Oh, he can't control it yet. Yes, what is it? Look at him having to charge up. He's having to boom. Boom. I was about to say, you're going to let people die because it's winter time? Oh, 
Oh my god. I was about to say, he's gonna let people just die because it's winter to like, you've gotta figure that shit out. <laughs> yeah, he's just a Pokemon. We've talked about this. He just does he does surf and fire blast. That's it. He can't precisely use it. Yeah, we all can do multiple things at the same time. Ah, uh, this is what I wanted with All Might and Deku. Just running the, running the streets. Sitting on top of buildings and training and shit. This is great for Endeavor, too. He's getting to build up a mystique in front of them. Yeah. Those who aren't exceptions. Ah, oh, so great for him. So great. And he's doing it in front of the three main characters of the story. But does he feel like he's reached his limit there? It's time. Mm hmm. Mmm. That was a good episode. It actually went by really fast. It actually does. That's actually good because I feel like all the kids, like, they've been trying to just, like... I'm not saying the UA is bad. Hold on. Let's scroll through this, see if there's an after credit. Oh, we don't do previews out here. Um... I feel like, I mean, it is school, so it's like a fast pace, but like, we're learning special moves. All right, come up with your name. All right, battles, tournaments, more special moves. And like, like Endeavor said, you know, you gotta be able to parallel process things, but can I just focus on like, one thing at a time? <laughs> I know, but there's a lot of pressure on them as well. Like you said, what Hawks was saying and Endeavor kind of picked up on, if they fail, if the top of the top, because it was All Might, you know, we did not have to worry. It was Superman. We had Superman. We had Goku. We had whatever you wanted it to be. He was always going to be there. Nobody was going to be as strong as him. He could handle it. Everybody else, we can slack off. School, like, hey, if you become a hero, you know, that's great. But, you know, All Might's going to be here. You know, do what you want to do. Strive for what you want to strive for. When he fell, though, it, like, shook the world on both sides. Villain and hero, as we saw. So the bar, it was like, All Might here villains here if there was ever an issue he could just come down here clean it and he's always going to be up here when he got knocked off all of a sudden it was like heroes villains just here so if they were to fail endeavor gets defeated hawks the hero agents profession just crumbles the kids are next in line 
you know, you like the ones at the top of the top schools. Like we even saw Tornado Boy and some of the others. Um, like they are next in line if it was to fall apart. And right now they're not ready. So we have seeing them talk about, you know, we got to get them back out there on the hero work, the work studies and all that stuff was kind of cool to see and the reasoning behind it. Um, I still need a little more explanation on the, um, what are we even, ta what are we calling them again? Um, the league, not league, but what are they? The liberation group. Is Shigaraki the one controlling that behind the scenes? Is the Liberation Army controlling Shigaraki, but he doesn't really care because it helps. Th they both want to like crumble the hero society, and they're like, "Hey, we both want the same thing." No one's really one upping the other. Um, that's what I'm saying. Like, I was thinking, you know, they were. I was thinking we had the League Liberation heroes. Liberation wants what the heroes want, but doesn't want to act in hero restraints. We still want to defeat this, but they're willing to work with them. Why is that? And they're ex-pro heroes as well. So, got to see the deciding factors and everything behind that. But, solid episode. We'll keep it pumping from there. Again, tomorrow, or today. Well, today you're seeing this. Tomorrow, One Piece for both um, YouTube and Patreon. And then we'll get the Parasite up. And then we'll just keep pumping along. I appreciate it, everybody. Like, share, subscribe, and as always.